In this video, we're going to learn how to go f between rational exponents and radicals. This is called converting them from one type of format to another. If we divide the exponent by the index, then the nth root of a to the m could be rewritten. With a to the m first, and just as we've been doing all along, dividing the exponent by the index. The index is always the denominator in the exponent. In example one, we're asked to write as an exponent this radical. Since we know the base is m and the exponent is 5, we know that we have to divide the exponent by the index, which is 7. So now we have a fractional exponent of 5 sevenths. In example two, we need to write the exponential form as a radical. We know that since the denominator represents the index, we can rewrite the radical part as the cubed root of something. AB is what's inside the radical and everything is raised to the second power because the numerator of the fractional exponent is 2. Let's move on to example 3. We need to write as a radical x to the negative 4 fifths. Remember that a negative exponent means that you need to put it in the denominator to change the sign of the exponent to be positive. So let's go ahead and do that now. Now that we have 1 over x to the 4 fifths, we can rewrite this whole thing in the denominator as a radical. 1 over the fifth root of x to the fourth. You could also write this as one over the fifth root of x all raised to the fourth. It means the same thing. In example four, we have one over the cubed root of 5x all raised to the second, and we need to write it as an exponent. First, let's go ahead and rewrite the denominator as a fractional exponent. 1 over 5x, and the exponent is 2, the index is 3. If we want to bring this whole denominator out of the no denominator into the numerator, we have to change the sign of the exponent. So it becomes 5x raised to the negative 2 thirds.